Welcome back to Friday Night Gaming. We are playing The Forgotten City. So I paused the game, thought I paused the game, went, got something to eat, and I came back and I was dead. So I have no idea what happened. So I just loaded the last checkpoint. So we're gonna have to talk to Dooley again. Uh, but just a quick recap. We found this lost city. We were, we actually, we were rescued by Karen from the river. She told us to go find Al. We found Al in these ancient ruins. He was actually dead. And he was talking about you either die or you go through the portal and things keep happening and you die again. Well, obviously we're gonna go through the portal because if we're gonna die regardless, we might as well have a little fun. We found ourselves in this forgotten city. We Everybody was talking about this golden rule, which the golden rule is no one can commit a crime of any kind. You commit a crime, everybody dies. So I was talking to the head honcho, the magistrate. He's worried about the election. Someone's probably going to be committing a crime, uh, breaking the golden rule. So he wants us to investigate everybody. And I'm just gonna move this real quick, just in case something happens. And so we're, the last few episodes, we're talking to people, getting information, asking them what their story is, collecting a lot of missions. So that's kind of where we're at. We're still meeting the people in the area and gathering information. And it's been a lot of fun. So this is a, uh, a ex adventure game where we explore and kind of figure out what's going on. Nobody knows how they got here. That's why I think we're in limbo and Karen was the the one she's like the gatekeeper of limbo never trust a karen i guess <laughs> so it's been a lot of fun so far so we're going to be repeating this a little bit like i said i died i don't know what happened and i was afraid that if i um kind of caught up we might miss something so again My what's your story David. so i'm gonna oh, say I okay i can skip so i'll just skip through what do you do or what did you do okay did something Okay, so I'm going to try to keep the same dialogue, dialogue and then we're going to break him out. Is that all? I said I did it. Liability. Thank you. All right, take item. What does it say? It says you were caught trespassing. What treasure? He said, if anything ever happened, he gave me this key. And we know about Hannibal. No, no. If you give me the lock, I can try to figure it out. Okay. Hannibal. And he's like, well, let me free, blah, blah, blah. Let me talk to the magistrate. Okay, this is where we left off. So let me talk to the magistrate about getting out of here. Uh, the magistrate put you in here for a reason. So I'm just going to say, let me talk to the magistrate about getting you out of here. Valerius already tried that. He said the magistrate wouldn't listen, no matter what. Then maybe it's time we had a new magistrate. Uh, maybe I'll just break you out. Oh, la, 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 la. What do I want to do? Maybe I'll just break you out. What about the rules? I don't want everyone to get in trouble because I was bad. Okay, then maybe it's time we had a new magistrate. Okay, figure out Galerius. how to get Galerius elected nice. as magistrate. Like he made me a doll and everything. If you help make him magistrate, he can get me out of here, and I can give you the key to my treasure. To the treasure! Hannibal said it was in the cisterns. Get Julie's key in the upper cabinet by releasing him from prison. That, okay. It was way up high and very precious. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Um, do you know, I'm really curious how I died, because <laughs> I literally was just staring at this guy. Do you know a way out of here? You're going to let me out of here? No, how, do you know? Really? No. Well, I can try, let me talk to Master again. That's not what I said, I asked if you know how to get a way out of here. Please. I hate it here. It makes me very sad. Dude, I get it. I feel for you. Uh, put you in here. Never mind. Okay, what do you think about the golden? I feel like we're not gonna get anything out of him, but I'm gonna ask no. anyways. You think treasure? Let's talk about your treasure. My Hannibal used to look after me. He said he always would, but then he died. It was very sad. He said. If anything ever happened to him, 
I had to find something very precious hidden away. He gave me this key and made me promise to keep it safe until I found the treasure. But I couldn't find it. All I remember is he said something about assistance. But when I went up to the high one, they put me in here. Now nobody looks after me. Except my friend Galerius. And Ek. Ek. The priestess lady. She's a nice lady. Fair enough. I feel Bye-bye. like Dooley is either playing us or he truly is an innocent soul. The many Whoa. shall suffer for the sins of the one. It's the statues. They're alive. Run? What? What? Run away! <laughs> oh my god! Follow the magistrate. Am I going the right? Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Follow, follow the butterflies. No, I just got here. I'm innocent. I don't know what's going on. The crazy lady's gone. So did I, Ethel? Oh, I wonder if it's gonna start back at the beginning. Uh, okay. Loop through time once. Okay. So there's a possibility that we can go through this. Follow back to the shrine and use the portal again. Okay. Main goal complete. Run. Okay, so that's what happens when we go. We break the golden rule, <laughs> but we just run to the portal and then we just start all over again. That's kind of ah. Uh... <laughs> uh, salve, friend. I'm Galerius. Mind telling me who you are and what you were doing in the shrine of Proserpina? I'm Razitin the second. We've had this conversation before. Uh, I don't think so. I've never seen you before in my life. Your name is Glul, and it, you're about to offer to take me to see uh, Sentius so he can tell us about the Golden Rule. Oh, Bacchus, how much did I drink last night? Uh, sorry to have bothered you. No problem. I got to go. Oh, and since you seem to be in a hurry, you should try out this device I made. Worked real hard on it. A bow and arrow? A flashlight? A gun? Um... A zip line? Yes! A zip line! Hell yeah! Just attach the pulley to the rope over the lake and hang onto the handle. Hell yeah! If it works, it'll be faster than walking. And if it doesn't work, worst thing that can happen is you'll take a swim in the lake. I haven't quite summoned the courage to test it myself. But don't worry, it's completely safe. Probably. I'm not worried. Thanks. I'm gonna. All I'm, right. I'm gonna be going. See you around. Oh yes. Oh. So that's down. All right. I see where I have to go. So how does this work? How does this work? Okay. Woo! Oh God. All right. <laughs> Little sack of potatoes to break my f- uh, break my fall or stop me. Alright, 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 alright. So do we just keep doing the same things we did before? This way. This way? Where way? Like, is this way? Am I going the right way? Hi, right, what's up? Keep an eye out for Centilla, would you? Wait. Do you know who I am? What is it, citizen? Oh. All right. So I wonder, let's talk to what's her face and go with a different uh let's not piss oh, her off. Another one fresh out of the baths. Another I take one it. fresh out the test. 
Oh, I wish Horatius would stop letting barbarians in here. What do hmm. you want? Uh, what do you think of the Golden Rule? You know, some people say it's the creation of an all-seeing god who's watching everything we do. But what kind of an awful, incompetent god would let my sister go missing on his or her watch? Fair Did question. Did you hear that? Curse you, you coward! Where is my sister? What do you have to say for yourself? No response. Nothing. <laughs> Oh, I thought she was That's yelling at I us. Thought. I was like, but I didn't say anything. I'm telling you, this mysterious god of ours has to be asleep on the job. Either that, or like people are saying, it really is just a children's fable my father is exploiting to frighten us into behaving. It's definitely real. I suppose we'll find out sooner or later. Hmm. I suppose we will. Um, what's your story? I'm Sentia, eldest daughter of the magistrate. But you'd know that if you'd been invited in here. All right, we're gonna what skip. What are you doing in here? I'm, a, I'm not from around really? here. Now remind me, why are we having this conversation? Um, do you know a way out of oh, here? What so her sister you? escaped. Well, Can I help? I don't know. Can you? When did you last see her? <sighs> we went in. Was she seeing I someone? So. Why is that? Because of... Is it possible? I don't know. All I know... You really aren't from his fam... You're surprisingly relaxed. Why? Okay. Uh, because I'm on this couch and not pacing... I hope you're not... Just an observation. If you must know, I'm here because my father has forbidden ah, okay. me from Okay, here we go. New dialogue. Villa. I couldn't bear to lose you too, he says, as if he loves me, and not because he needs at least one daughter he can trade off. Hmm. You really aren't from oh, here, right? Asked that. His... that doesn't surprise me. To him, it was like a pri- He's- a... That's all the questions so I have. So you'll help me find her? Oh. All right, sure, oh, I'll do it. Thank you. You should probably take a look through her room. It's the one just by the front door. Maybe you'll find something the rest of us missed. I'll get right thank on it. Thank you. So what I'm curious, do I have all the... Okay, so I still have all my main objectives and my leads. Okay, cool. I was like, gosh, if I have to talk to everybody all over again and be like, yeah, I know. Uh, examine ink jar, a, a ceramic ink jar, ink mirrors be, okay, we, we've learned that. Ooh, a brass mirror. A uh, brass, the brass has been polished into a, into a mirror, <laughs> which has been used for applying makeup. Oh, that's cool. A uh, small vial containing a rudim rudimentary perfume made from flowers and oil. Hopefully that's right. No. Cosmetic jar or brass jar containing some sort of power powder for makeup. All right. Oh, hello. No. Oh, that's right. I discovered jumping. Uh, What else? Oh, a note. Scintilla to Scintilla. Give you the strength to forgive me. I'm sorry I have to leave you this way, but I have found a way to escape. And Jay must take, and I must take it. Oh, we meet again someday. Okay, so take this. Let's go back. Oh, don't mind me. I just live here. Oh. What have you discovered? I found a letter in her room which mentioned her plan to escape. What? Really? Yep. I swear, I searched her room top to bottom Apparently and never saw that. Apparently not good enough. I wonder how I could have missed it. Strange, but well done, I suppose. But it's odd. It was only a few months ago that Santilla's friend Yulia let slip she was planning an escape of her own. And yet, Yulia's still here. You should go and speak with her. Find out if she knows anything. She lives in the villa next door. All right. 
ask Lily about the escape plan. All right, do I have an icon? Is this highlighted? Oh wait, vanishing act. Okay, track. Okay, how come it's not track? What did I just select? All right, no. Okay, so... The villa next door, so it's not this way. Oh, don't mind me. I just live here. Swing. Is it is that the villa over there? Help me, game. Keep an eye out for Centella, would you? Yeah, yeah. Hey, Horatius. Yeah, 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 yeah. Unless this is the villa. All right. I thought the door unlocked. I was like, oh. Is there another way in? Oh. Ooh, I'm trespassing. This is a sin. So I'm gonna go back. Okay, so I don't know where she is. As if I'll be afraid of you, little man. So I wonder if her villa is this way. Okay, I don't know what she want me to do. Wait, what? Oh no, right way, right way. Maybe the right way. <laughs> I don't think this is the right way. All right, I'm lost. All right, we're back where we started. The villa next door. Can I get a map? Oi, oi, oi. I'm hitting X, it's not. All right, I am a rational adult. So if she's not there... On your best behavior, I trust. Uh, uh, cool. What business is that of yours? I'm looking for her. A lot of people have been looking for her. But it's been three weeks and we've found nothing. What makes you think you can do better? Well, sounds like you don't want me looking for her. Sometimes fresh eyes mm. help. I suppose that's true. Do you notice anything suspicious before she went missing? I know what you did to her. Let's talk about something else. Centilla was always a kind, well-behaved young woman. I admit, her disappearance really caught me off guard. If anyone knows something, I'd expect it to be Centia, Maliolus, Claudia, or Demetrius. But none of them will tell me anything. You might feel better, though, I suppose. All right, let's talk about something right. else. I'll be going now. All right. Please keep an eye out for anything that might lead us to Centilla. All right. Let's make a good impression. Oh, he didn't see me talking to... Mariola's What's his name? isn't receiving visitors at the moment. It being election day. Oh, you know, that's cool. That's cool. Um... I need to speak with... She's not here. Where is she? Had to carry her to Lucretia's clinic this morning. Shrine of Apollo. She was acting sick. Faking it, if you ask me. Typical. 
Do you know anything about the disappearance of uh, Sinatella? I don't abduct wow. women. They come to me. Oh. And they keep coming back. If you know what I mean. I think you're hiding some. Yes, yeah, subtle, but I think I know what you mean. <laughs> Uh, do you know a way out of here? I'm not gonna ask any of these questions. Okay. Whatever. Just remember. I'll, I'll be, be watching. watching. Yes. Oh! Translate. Is it an Uh. Okay. So where is... Where is the Shrine of Apollo? Isn't the Great Temple majestic? So I guess that's the Great Temple. I assume that's the Temple of Apollo. Hey, do you know where I can find a new face? Ave and may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, how they? I've been asking people how they end up here, and I'm trying to find a pattern. Interesting. I'm not sure why you're telling me, but you've come to the right person. Not really. Okay. Oh, keep live. Come back to me. Is this the way to Apollo? I need your help. Okay. Well, help me find Apollo's temple. Mm. Oh my. Oh, there's a note. Just gonna walk around. Seek a what? Straight as an obtain a bow. What? I'm locking myself in. Don't try to follow me. Nothing good will come. What is happening behind there? Sounds like someone's getting smacked. The assassin's bow. Do you have a bow? Well, there's arrows, but there's no bow. Alright, be smarter than the game. Find a bow. Seek a bow. What do you what do you think I'm doing? Oh, I'm stuck. Uh you don't have a bow. Seek a bow. Oh, that's um, it's a little windy down here or up here. Uh, do you guys know where a bow is by chance? The assassin's bow. Oh, swing! You saw nothing. I feel like the bow has to be around here. Okay, I get it. What is ha- you know, I maybe I don't even want to go in there. I guess... I guess I'll just move on. I mean, I don't know where it is. Well, could you give me some waypoints? Uh, boulder? Help me find this bow? Oh, I feel like we can not go this way. Okay. <laughs> oh no! Oh, so many places to go. I'm gonna go this way. <gasps> Ooh, a secret! 
Okay. Find a creative way. <laughs> Seeing if I could move them and the boulder would move. Looking for a bow. Oh. Hey, girl. Salve, friend. I'm Octavia. Welcome to life under the golden rule. It's a ghastly thing, is it not? How are you faring so far? Good. I'm fine. Ah, another stoic, perhaps. We all need something to help us through times like these. We've all been where you are now. I remember when I first arrived. I used to lay awake at night contemplating the big questions. Why am I here? Is there a way out? What is the golden rule and who or what is responsible for it? I still don't have any of the answers, I'm afraid. I don't think anybody does. But I'm happy to share with you what I've learned. Oh, absolutely. What's your story? Here, in this place, the Magistrate has me earning my keep by cleaning and pruning the gardens. It's not quite how I expected my life to go. I used to live in a lovely villa on the banks of the Tiber. I was even betrothed to a handsome young man from a prominent family. Mm. But long hours of menial labour for the good of the community has its own charms too, I suppose. How did you end up here? Let's talk about something else now. How did you oh, end up here? much the same way as many of the others. When the fires came to Rome, seven months ago, my family and I fled for the Tiber, hoping to escape on a barge. We were among the fortunate ones with enough coins for passage, but unfortunately, there were a lot of desperate people, and they boarded before we could depart. A scuffle broke out, and I was pushed overboard. The last thing I remember was the water, rising up to hit my cheekbone. I woke up by the river, near that shrine, and stumbled across this place. I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, that's all right. I'm sure it's all part of God's plan for me. Let's hope so. Let's talk about something else. If you like. Do you know a way out of here? What do you think about the golden rule? I'm afraid not. Although I did once hear someone gossiping down at Aurelia's tavern about a possible way out. I don't put a lot of stock in such rumors, but if you're desperate and wealthy, you could look into it, I suppose. If that doesn't work, then I suppose we're all stuck here until gods, uh, the gods, decide our fate. Thank you, I'll look into I it. I hope it works out. What do you think of the golden hmm. rule? The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. I think about those words a lot. I'd like to think that if we all love our neighbors as ourselves and do to them as we'd have them do to us, then we'll all be fine. But on the other hand, I was always taught the intent of man's heart is evil from his youth, and that all of us are born with a tendency towards sin. And that's where I get stuck. Is it true? Are we born with a tendency towards sin? I don't think so. I think people are fundamentally good. You don't think that's a little naive? Nope. Hmm. I suppose you've never seen what I've seen. Innocent men and women, torn apart in arenas while thousands of Romans look on and cheer. Fair point, perhaps you're right. No, I stand by what hmm. I said. I wish I shared your faith. Oh, uh, so you're a Christian. Please, please keep that to yourself. I found one! I know you're not from around here, but Things are very difficult for us right now. There was a terrible fire in Rome last year, and our emperor decided to make us his scapegoats. There were executions. It was horrible. Your secret is safe with me. Oh, thank you. You have no idea how much I appreciate that. I shall be going now. Right, well, it was lovely to meet you. Oh man, I do you know where to getting to know you better is? over the coming months. 
And if you ever... I can't believe this oh. is how it ends. What? No! No! Oh, no. No. I can't no, move. No, 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 no. It won't let me move. Oh, P.S., what are you oh, doing? Oh, but I can zoom in. back from there. If you lose your balance, you'll fall. That's the idea. No! What? Why? Why would you want that? Why do you think I'm stuck for the rest of my life working for a man who treats me like an animal? I know, I know things are hard for you right now. They're hard for all of us. We're all in this together, Alpheus. Please, please just think this through. If you do this, it could be the sin that seals all of our fates. Is oh. that what you want? I'm sorry, but I just don't care anymore. Oh, no. Please, Alpheus. Help him. If he goes through with it, it could be the end for us all. But I don't know what to do. I've never had to deal with this sort of thing. Please, you need to talk to him. Uh, Alright, I'll Thank talk to you. him. <laughs> and please, choose your words carefully. Let me guess. You're going to lecture me on how suicide is a crime against the Empire. No, it's wrong, you know it. I was going to ask you what's wrong. I screwed up my life. That's what's wrong. I borrowed money and when I couldn't pay it back, I wound up in debt bondage. I'll be stuck slaving away for that Culus Cumulatis Maliolus for the rest of my life. What if I give you money? I'm out. Wherever you are, Centilla, my love. Oh, I'm sorry. no. Oh, Pierce, no. I know. I can't believe he went through with it. I, oh lord, that poor lamb. Uh, well, his suicide didn't break the golden rule, so what does that mean? <laughs> well, I suppose it means suicide isn't a sin under the golden rule. So I guess that means whichever god is responsible for it, it isn't mine. What happens I'll now? I'll have to let everyone know what happened. And I guess Maliolus will have to clean up the mess in his villa. It's of his own making, after all. And I'd best pray for poor Alpheus. Jump! jump in a second follow but is there a all right leap of faith scream thank you thank you i am delighted and deeply honored to have been elected to your magistrate magistrate oh <laughs> i was like delighted and deeply honored <gasps> i made it inside <laughs> I made it inside. Uh, I make this solemn promise to you, good citizens. Um, can I talk to you? Did you just leap into my villa from the balcony a hundred feet above? Maybe. That was either extremely reckless or impressively <gasps> clever. His eye colors well, are different. Why have you risked life and limb to see me? Uh, I want you to withdraw from the election. Uh, what's your story? I'm Maliolus. And if it wasn't for this interruption, I'd be practicing my victory speech for the election later today. What will you do if you win? I'm glad you asked. I'll finally restore freedom to this city, just as I've been promising. These good people have suffered long enough under Sentius's tyranny. How will you do that? By declaring there's no such thing as the Golden Rule. It's a children's fable exploited by Sentius to frighten us into submission. Wait, don't tell me you've fallen victim to that monstrous lie. Uh, what makes you sure that it's... Uh, okay, the golden rule is definitely real. What makes you sure it's not real? The person making a claim bears the onus of proving that claim. Can you do that? Can you prove the golden rule is real? Yes. Nonsense. There's no way you can prove that. If it was real and you'd seen someone break it, then you'd be dead already. I'm reliving the same day over and over again. The golden rule is broken each time. 
What would it take to prove you it's real? Books, notes, even I can if I can't prove it. If I'm right, then accepting it will avert disaster. If I'm wrong, then accepting it would make the city better place. Isn't that a good thing? Surely you're not one of those people who believes everything you read. As if a lie could be transformed into the truth by the simple act of writing it down. Yeah, I'm reliving. What? Oh. Oh, He's gonna I think see I'm crazy. Another poor, vulnerable soul taken in by Sentius's machinations. He won't get away with this much longer. Listen. I see nothing I say. E okay, so even if I can't prove it, if I'm right, then accepting it, or uh, if I'm wrong, so I'm gonna make this even. True, but that is simply because you are mistaken. Um, do you know a way out of here? What do you think of the golden rule? I already know that. I'll ask of with course its disappearance. Not. But as I always say, if Sentius can't protect his daughter, how can we trust him to protect this city? What aren't you telling me? Look, if you're trying to find her, you may wish to check the cisterns beneath this villa. Domitius says he saw a body there some weeks back. Really? Of course, just to be clear, I take no responsibility for what happens to you down there. That's cool. Uh, what do you think of the gold? I already know this, you but... You mean the children's fable exploited by Sentius to scare us all into doing what he wants? Do you know a way out of here? I'm afraid not. We're stuck down here together, for better or worse. We're all going to have to make the best of it. I want you to withdraw from this election. I don't want to say that, honestly. I'll be going now. I trust you can see yourself out. Yeah, absolutely. Through the door this time. There's a key just beside it. Oh, sweet. All right. And we'll head out in the next episode of Friday Night Gaming. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Bye. Still here. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah.